Sonnet seventeen from Amoretti by Edmund Spencer. This is recorded to celebrate the seventh anniversary of LibriVox. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. The glorious portrait of that angel's face, made to amaze weak men's confused skill, and this world's worthless glory to embase, what pen, what pencil can express her fill? For though he colours could devise at will, and eke his learned hand at pleasure guide, least trembling it his workmanship should spill, yet many wondrous things there are beside the sweet eye-glances that like arrows glide, the charming smiles that rob sense from the heart, the lovely pleasance and the lofty pride cannot expressed be by any art. A greater craftsman's hand thereto doth need that can express the life of things indeed. End of Sonnet 17 from Amoretti by Edmund Spencer Recording by Bob Gonzalez.